What is a laser stone fragmentation? How does it work? What are kidney stones? And what's the recovery process like? Hi, I am Mr. Sarath Nalagatla, consultant urological surgeon at Rossall Hospital, part of Circle Health Group. Today, I'll be answering some of your most commonly asked questions about laser fragmentation surgery, what the process looks like, and how the surgery helps you recover from kidney stones. So, if you are about to have this surgery, or you know someone who is, you have come to the right place. Without further ado, let's begin. What are kidney stones? First things first. A kidney stone is like a tiny hard rock that can form inside your kidneys. Your kidneys act like filters for your body. They sift through your blood to remove waste and extra substances your body doesn't need. Sometimes though these minerals and salts can clump together. When these clumps get bigger and don't pass through your urine, they become kidney stones. Sometimes if a kidney stone is very small, your body can pass it naturally through your urine and you might not even notice that this has happened. Kidney stones that get stuck can cause intense pain and discomfort that often feels like a sharp ache in your back and side. In a nutshell, a kidney stone is a hard little rock that forms inside your kidney. It can make you feel pretty miserable if it decides to move around and get stuck on its way out. What are the main symptoms of kidney stones? The most common symptoms of kidney stones can feel like your body's way of telling you something is not right. Intense pain is often the superstar symptom. Imagine a sharp, stabbing pain in your side or back, right below your ribs. It can be so severe that it might make you want to wriggle around or find a comfortable position, but it's tough to find relief. Sometimes the pain can start in your side or back, then move down towards your lower abdomen or groin area as the stone tries to make its grand exit. You might notice that you need to pee more frequently or there's a burning sensation when you do. You could also experience pain or discomfort during urination. Kidney stone pain can be so intense that it makes some people feel nauseated or even sick. If you see pink, red, or brownish tinges in your urine, it could be due to small amounts of blood coming from the irritated tissues around the stone. Your urine might not look or smell quite right when you have a kidney stone. You might feel like you need to pee all the time, even when there is not much urine to pass. Not everyone with kidney stones will experience all of these symptoms. It can vary from person to person, but if you are ever in doubt and experiencing some of these signs, it's a good idea to get in touch with your doctor. What is laser fragmentation surgery for kidney stones? And how is the procedure performed? So, laser fragmentation for kidney stones is a procedure used to break down kidney stones using laser energy. Imagine you have a kidney stone that's causing you a lot of pain or blocking your urine flow. In this procedure, your doctor will use a tiny flexible tube called erythroscope to get to the stone. It's inserted through your urinary tract. Then they will pass a thin laser fiber through this tube and direct it at the stone. The laser releases powerful energy that effectively breaks the stone into smaller, more manageable pieces. Think of it like using a laser to crack a hard stone into smaller, more easily possible fragments. These smaller pieces can then either be passed naturally 
through your urine or in some cases removed with additional tools. The greater thing about this procedure is that it's minimally invasive, which means your doctor doesn't have to make any big cuts or incisions to remove the kidney stone. This usually leads to a quicker recovery time and less pain compared to traditional surgical methods. So, in a nutshell, laser fragmentation for kidney stones is a high-tech way to break up kidney stones so your body can get rid of them more easily. It's a significant advancement in how we treat kidney stones. What type of doctor performs laser fragmentation surgery? The kind of doctor who performs laser fragmentation surgery for kidney stones is typically a urologist. Urologists are specialists in the urinary system, which includes your kidneys, bladder, and all things related to urine flow. So, if you're dealing with the kidney stones and laser fragmentation sounds like a potential solution for you, it's a good idea to reach out to a urologist like me. They will be the ones to assess your situation, discuss your treatment options, and if needed, perform the laser stone fragmentation surgery to help you get better. How do you prepare for laser fragmentation surgery for kidney stones? Preparing for laser fragmentation surgery for kidney stones isn't too different from getting ready for any other medical procedure. First, you'll have a consultation with your urologist. They will discuss the procedure with you, explain why it's needed, and answer any questions you might have. This is your chance to clear up any doubts and make sure you are comfortable with the plan. You will likely undergo some tests like blood work and imaging to ensure you are in good health for the surgery. Your doctor will need to know your medical history and any medications you are taking. So be ready to provide all these details. Usually you will need to avoid eating or drinking anything for a few hours before the surgery. Your doctor will give you specific instructions on when to stop eating and drinking. This helps preventing complications during the procedure. If you are on any medications, especially blood thinners, your doctor might ask you to adjust your dosage or temporarily stop taking them in the days leading up to the surgery. Be sure to follow these instructions closely. Since you'll be under anesthetic for the procedure, it is important to arrange for someone to drive you home afterwards. You won't be in any condition to operate a vehicle. Your urologist or the team will provide you with detailed pre-operative instructions. This might include showering with a special soap, not wearing any jewelry, and wearing loose, comfortable clothing on the day of the surgery. Don't hesitate to ask any last minute questions or express any concerns you might have on the day of the procedure. Your medical team is there to support you and ensure you are as comfortable as possible. How do you recover from laser fragmentation surgery for kidney stones? Recovering from laser fragmentation surgery for kidney stones is usually a step-by-step -step process and it's all about giving your body time to heal. Right after the surgery, you'll likely spend some time in the recovery area while the effects of anesthesia wear off. You might feel a bit groggy or disoriented, but that's completely normal. You might experience some discomfort or pain in your lower back or abdomen. Your healthcare team will provide pain medications to keep you as comfortable as possible during this time. It might also be a little uncomfortable to pee at first, but this will get better pretty quickly. Staying hydrated is 
crucial. Your doctor will encourage you to drink plenty of fluids to help flush out any remaining stone fragments and to prevent dehydration. You'll be monitored for a few hours to ensure there are no immediate complications. They will check your vital signs and make sure you're doing well. Most people can go home the same day as the surgery, but you won't be driving yourself. Remember to have someone there to pick you up. Once you are home, it's all about rest. You might still feel some discomfort and that's okay. Take it easy and don't push yourself too hard. Your body needs time to heal. Your doctor might prescribe some medications like antibiotics or pain relievers to take at home. Follow the prescribed regimen carefully. Your urologist may recommend changes to your diet to prevent new kidney stones from forming. This often involves drinking plenty of water and avoiding certain foods that can contribute to stone formation. Depending on your individual recovery, you will gradually be able to return to your regular activities. Your doctor will let you know when it's safe to do things like exercise or go back to work. Remember, everyone's recovery timeline is a bit different. Some people bounce back quickly, while others may take a bit more time. The key is to be patient with yourself and follow your doctor's instructions. If you have any concerns during your recovery, do not hesitate to reach out to your medical team. They are there to support you on your road to feeling better after dealing with kidney stones. Most people make a full recovery within 10 days, but you should expect to return to work within seven. You can be back to your usual activities and enjoying normal life within two weeks without kidney stones and the unpleasant symptoms that often come with them. So, there you have it, a run-through of laser fragmentation surgery, including what it actually is and how is it performed and how long it takes to recover from the procedure. If you would like to discuss kidney stones in more detail and whether this surgery is right for you, you can book an appointment with me online at circlehealthgroup.co.uk. If there is any more information you would like to know about this surgery, feel free to pop a question in the comment section of this video.